after a fourth place finish at Las Vegas had improved Chase Elliott now to 30 points above the playoff cut line. It seems like, Chase, you guys have sort of been flying under the radar. I mean, you haven't let a ton of laps since that win at Watkins Glen, but really solid finishes. How much longer can you guys kind of keep running this path? Well, hopefully we can uh, get back to victory lane soon. I mean, that's the goal. So uh, our guys did a, a really nice job last week in overcoming uh, a good bit of adversity, I thought, throughout the race to come back and, and finish where we did. So really proud of our effort and our Napa team. And uh, hopefully we have another fast Chevrolet Camaro tonight. And we can, uh, you know, finish a couple spots ahead of where we start. We'll see. Yeah, because you start third, so that would be uh, uh, ideal. It seems like something has clicked for you here as of late. What is different from maybe your first trips here other than uh, this uh I don't know, does that creep you out at all? Yeah, I, I don't know, but, um, yeah, you know, I don't know. I, I wish I could sit here and tell you I'm doing something different or, or we're doing something different, but, um... We execute and do the job that, that we can do, and I do the job that I can do. I think we can run with whoever, and I feel really confident about that. And uh, hopefully we hit our stride at the right time and can execute these next nine weeks like I know we can. And if we do that, I think we'll be in good shape. All right, that's Chase Elliott and a cameo there by Kyle Busch. Yeah, Chase not even flinching. We're going to hear from Kyle Busch coming up.